Option one, first things first, purchase a dry steam cleaner from Gumbuster. Purchase the training and marketing that Gumbuster offers. Then you're good to go. Start small, provide cleaning services for homes, make money, save money, use your savings to buy a second dry steam cleaner. Build a team, hire someone. Repeat to expand business and make more money. <laughs> oh my God. This would work because you like to get dirty and this job allows you to be hands-on. You'll be the first Gumbuster business in the central New York and there's no need to spend time figuring out marketing strategies, Gumbuster provides that. You have many contacts that would be great as potential customers. However, you won't be able to use machines for retail because Gumbuster has a patent. There is big financial risk. You will have to take out a loan for marketing package. There is high fit pensions. Someone might have seen the episodes and decide to work with Gumbuster. And you have never worked with a dry steam cleaner before. Option two. First, partner with Technovap to become the exclusive dealer in the States. Next, start cleaning out your garage because you are going to need somewhere to store those cleaners. Then, trade in your car for a van so that you can deliver the cleaners. Use your contacts wisely. Sell to your father's power plant. Talk to the school that you work in. Sell or rent the cleaners throughout their networks. Expand your contacts over time from your school district to central New York and eventually all of New York State. <laughs> This would work because you'll be able to work with the city of Syracuse, which will make it much easier to expand to other cities. Dry steam cleaners aren't usually involved in people's daily cleaning routines, so providing a rental service would benefit people who just need a deep clean every once in a while. You are going to be handed money by Technobath to help with the startup, and you won't actually be doing any of the cleaning yourself, so if you want to keep your day job while it gets going, totally doable. However, this is going to be your first entrepreneurial experience. Your whole business will be depending on Technovap and you will have to actually spend a lot of time marketing and branding your company. And you do not have the chance to do the dirty jobs that you have a great passion for. What do you think can you do? Option one, option two, option one, option two, option one, option one, option one. We recommend option two. Ken will be his own boss. The initial cost for option two is cheaper. And because Ken will be partnering with Technobat, he will be able to make his own decisions. Option two has a lower threat of entrance than option one. And option two has more potential in expanding its market across the country, which means more money for Ken.